So, hi guys, uh, I haven't made any English version kind of um, videos for a while, but I just got back home not long ago, like around 15 minutes ago. Um, I went to a movie, cinema. You know what this means? 3D movie. And then um, I watched The Ring 3D. Um, this is a mini review. I'm just telling you guys a little bit. This movie is so rubbish. So shit. So, um, if you guys, if you'd like your friend to you to go and watch it, I would say don't waste your time. Um, yeah, it's not worth the money. And you know 3D movie is quite expensive. Maybe you should go and watch Snow White or something. I haven't watched that, but I'm kind of interested in that. And then Man in Black and then Spider-Man maybe? Yeah, I will watch that. I prefer that more uh, because of the time thing. So I can't watch Snow White, so I need to choose doing. And then watch it with my cousin and stuff. And then they're, they're like scaredy cats. <laughs> they're too scared to watch it, but... Uh, it's not that scary. It's kind of it just doesn't make sense. That's all I can say. But um, yeah. By the way, the video is not about the movie. It's about this brand. I'm not sure. Do you guys know about this brand? It's uh, Lam Sam Yik in English, I think. But in Chinese, it's Lam Sam Yik. Sure, guys. Um, so this is like the leaflets. That's the name of the company. It's a Japanese company. I mean, no, sorry, not Japanese. It's a Taiwanese company. And then that's some Chinese the back. Lam sam yik zao so yik something. And then inside they have like different kind of brush inside. As you can see the shape really funky. This one is like a heart shape and then we have some kabuki and then we have a flower kabuki which is really interesting and then we have some heart shaped kabuki and then we have like a retractable, I don't know, portable kabuki brush that you can take with you anywhere and then they like dyed it, actually it's not a heart shape, it's a flower, sorry, got it wrong um, but this is like the normal kabuki and this is the flower one can you guys see that? The pink one there? I didn't get those kabukis because it's quite expensive, I'm telling you. So, I went to Hong Kong this Sunday, if I'm not wrong. And then I bought a set from the Lim, how to say in English? Lam, Lam Sam Ik. So, this is the bag that come with it. Uh, it's a pretty cute pouch, I'll say. There's a compartment here, and then there's side there's different compartments. And then they have a really mini, mini mirror here. Um, it's a real mirror. It's not like a fake one, like a the baby toy one. And the back of it is like that. Very girly, I'll say. Um, I wouldn't... I'm not sure about this kind of bag because it's not my kind of style. I like pink but lace and ribbon, not really for me. I like polka dot stuff, but it's okay, it's not bad. And then in the set, I need to talk really quiet because it's quite late now, so I, need to, I don't want to disturb my family sleeping, you know. So I won't go to the big things, I will just go to the small things first. They include five products, like five brushes inside. And then the first brushes is this very normal lip brush. You can use it for eyeliner if you want, but it's normally for lip. Just like a normal synthetic brush. And I like the way how this like diamante kind of stuff. On the tube, so it's more interesting. Not that and it's really hard to open you here. Know? Like, just put it back like that. Oops, nearly dropped that. It's okay. Um, so, yeah, nothing special about this, I would say. 
um, because I don't really use a little brush, but uh, it's good to have one, you know, you never know you need it. And then we have an eyeshadow brush, like the C shape, very normal everyday eyeshadow brush. And then this is like a purple kind of color, the barrel here, and then it has the name here. Here, lam sam ik, lam sam yik in Chinese, and then they have the mini logo there, and then this is also in, um synthetic eye, so it's good for cream stuff, um so it's good for applying base color, and then good for under eye concealer also, and you know for the blemish and that kind of stuff. So it's really good to have one in your bag, your makeup bag. And then something that I'm interested in, not many people use this, I think professional like makeup artists use this kind of stuff, not many girls use this I think, I think. Um, it's like a cone, but like with like very sharp needles on top of it, and then um, I use this, I think the purpose of this is to use it to like brush your um what do you call it your lashes so they don't clump together when you have mascara on and i really need this because yeah let's try it haven't tried it um my mascara is dried up so it's a bit hard to brush it through but uh, so yeah use it when it's wet i would say use it when your lashes are not clumped together so I'm really excited to try this. I recommend to get this kind of stuff. You know, you never know you need this kind of stuff because my lashes always clump together whenever I put mascara on. So that's that. Then second exciting thing in the bag is this. This is the I'm I think it's powder brush. I would say or a blush brush. See, it's like a blush brush, but you can use it as a powder. brush blush brush i mean not blush and then so sad this purple kind of thing and then like gold um print on the side and barrel and then that kind of stuff it's do you call this barrel or handle it's a handle right that's a barrel hmm i got a bit confused but it's a gold part and then we have this um black i have no idea is this a animals or synthetics the feeling of it is super duper soft it's so i washed it already by the way so don't be scared when i put it on my face i washed it already and it's super soft i washed it nothing came out no shedding no bleeding which is good because you know new brush they always bleed and you know that annoying kind of stuff see that it's this big same kind of size as my, I don't know, mouth, I don't know, cheek, it's bigger than my cheek of course, because I've got a big face, but anyway, um, so this brush is really soft, and I really recommend this, I haven't tried it on my face though, because I just, because I um, just washed it like not long ago, like this morning I would say, it's quite late now so it's dry and then let's see this is the most exciting thing in the bag it's a heart shaped blush brush can you see that it's like a little bomb 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 or you can say like a heart shape I, i'm not going to turn it upside down because i just this is not dry this brush is not dry because i just wash it this morning and then i put it in this thing so i can keep the hair like together and this one's pink special edition right and then there's the name very tiny and then the company's logo and this hair dyed pink and then i washed it no bleeding no shedding it just felt uber soft so and just but i don't know why but it just comes out you know can you see the hair yeah just came out like you know, like you know when you have messy hair i don't know what happened but uh, i hope i'll be all right if 
I put it in that plastic thing I hope it'll, it'll stay in shape um, but um, the bottom of it is more pink and then the top is a little bit like a baby pink very light pink and then this is good for blush good for highlights you know when you dab like um, what do you call it some highlight and then just put it here so it's really good for highlighting like you know it's good for your nose as well if you put like for blending as well like blending um, I can definitely tell this is um, animal hair so I think this is synthetic because there's no smell because um, whenever you wash like animal hair kind of hairbrush they have like a animal smell <laughs> I don't know how to describe it but there's like you know you know it's animal hair it's really hard to describe it I can tell this is animal hair but um, I think it's goat hair this one and there's no bleeding no shedding um, it's just really soft I can't say any bad thing about this um, but I haven't tried it on my face yet but this is my over review about this brand and then the total price of this pouch thing this set is I think it's a special set I'm not sure have you guys seen the drama from a uh, Taiwanese drama is called Fanai Fanale uh, Fanai Fanani um, they use this brush here like and then they make this set like a special edition that kind of stuff I think so that's why I went and bought it because I, I know this brand so long like long time ago but I just never get, got a chance to buy it because I can't get it from Macau um, and I don't think they have it in Hong Kong then but they like now they have like a mini miniature store in Hong Kong in Mong Kok in Tong Lo Wan I don't know Tong Lo Wan in English but anyway and then um, so I bought it and then the price of it is like 560 something Hong Kong dollar so if you convert it back to US or UK it's quite expensive but if you think about it, okay, 500 something. May I would say maybe 40 pound, 50 pound. If, if you convert back to pound, it's not that expensive for five brush. But to me, 500 something dollars kind of is like nearly 600. It's quite a lot. That's okay. So, yeah, that's that. I'm just, I'm really recommend this like brush. It's just super duper cute. Oh, come on, how can you resist from this brush? It is so cute and sweet, so girly, right? You can't say no to this brush. Look at that. And this brush as well, it's super duper soft. Okay, I'll show it here so you guys can see it properly. <laughs> anyway, this is dry already. And then I think this is good for like dusting powder, you know, that kind of stuff. Um, I didn't put any like face makeup on, I just have eye makeup on today. My skin's getting much better. Whenever I go back to Hong Kong, I mean Macau, my skin get better, much better than like when I'm in the UK. So I really like when I come back. I have really good skin when I come back. So yeah. But oopsie. So yeah, compare the shape of it. It's like very tiny. It's like same length as my hand, I would say. And I have a really small hand. Actually, my hand's longer, but you can see a difference. Like that. Or, yep. So I really recommend you guys check this out. And then I will put their like Facebook link below. You know, so you guys can have a look. And um, yeah, just check it out. Limsamic. Here, there we go. That's the English name of it. And I will see you guys soon. Bye bye.